Hi guys, um, I just wanted to make a video to show a problem that the Dell XPS 15 laptop has with uh, Optimus and uh, Adobe Flash. So the issue is that if you purchased a Dell XPS 15 laptop with the Core i5 processor and Optimus, uh, there seems to be an issue with Flash. Uh, where wherein when you play like flash videos the uh, whole c screen starts like flickering and you cannot see the controls um, I'll demonstrate this with a video on Vimeo which this is a HD video and uh, this will give you an idea of what I'm talking about uh, keep in mind that this is not altered in any way the drivers are just the ones that are supplied from Dell and uh, so I'll just demonstrate what the problem is so I'm gonna press play now and just go to go to full screen and as you can see the whole thing is like flickering and it will become more obvious when I go down as you can see the controls are just flickering you cannot even see the timeline control is just flickering uncontrollably so, so that you can see it there again like you can see the controls now but when I press play it goes off again so this is an issue that I've been seeing with uh, Chrome Internet Explorer and Firefox as well so it's an f I don't know what the reason is but uh, certain people in forums have been telling me to use uh, drivers from laptop video to go.com but let me tell you, I used those drivers and uh, what I found was Optimus was disabled. So if you use any drivers other than Dell on your laptop, the Optimus uh, technology will be disabled. So a way to show you this is, so there is actually a system tray icon that shows you if Optimus is working or not. And you can enable this notification icon by just going into the NVIDIA control panel and going to view and select the last option display GPU activity icon in notification area so that actually will tell you whether the laptop is now using the NVIDIA card or the Intel card and uh, when you want when you're playing a HD video uh, you know it's NVIDIA card that should come into picture so let me play this again and uh, the notification icon is right here Are you able so it shows you that Chrome is using NVIDIA's card right there so if I stop this video and close the tab or close the whole browser you can see that let me just focus there yeah so you can see that the GPU activity for NVIDIA is none, so it's switched back to Intel. So that's a good sign that Optimus is working. But the downside is that there is flickering that comes on when you use it. And um, I don't know why this issue is there. There seems to be some sort of trouble between um, uh, Adobe's uh, Flash and NVIDIA's Optimus. So I hope those guys get it fixed. Um, a way to make sure that this problem doesn't come, I mean it's not a fix per se but if you're really annoyed by it, uh, just go to the high def, I mean just play the video, but before you play it, just right click on the settings of Adobe Flash, uh, let me just um, take some time to stabilize the camera here. So. Let's go to right click the video. Okay, so just right click the video and go to settings. And see that option enable hardware acceleration? Well, just turn it off. And then press close. now just restart just restore the video and uh, you'll see that the flickering has disappeared 
so you can actually see the control without any flickering there so the downside to this fix is actually that the it's actually using the Intel card to run the video. So when you disable hardware acceleration in Adobe Flash, what you're actually doing is you're not letting Flash use the NVIDIA card to run the video. So that's actually a bummer. I don't know. I mean, that's really stupid. I mean, you expect these things to work seamlessly, but there seems to be some sort of driver issue. And uh, I, can, I can just show you that if you play it, it doesn't flicker at all again. So there's no flickering right now. to show you again it's Wait using the integrated card so that's actually kind of stupid I wish um, Are you I wish that um, Nvidia or um, Adobe fix this soon and uh, whatever you do guys uh, don't install the drivers from laptop video to go what does what that does is it actually screws up Optimus and makes everything run on just the integrated graphics so uh, you, you it'll be like you paid uh, money for NVIDIA's card for nothing you know so don't do that um, wait for Dell's drivers um, talk to Dell if you can I've emailed them for a response but I haven't gotten any so far um, hopefully this video will convince them maybe one of their PR guys will look at it and um, another thing is like so I have a LCD monitor it's just a standard 23 inch uh, full HD monitor which I use sometimes to watch some movies and what happens is um, with these drivers just installed with Dell's drivers that is and uh, uh, the hardware acceleration actually enabled what happens is um, let me just show you what happens so I'm going to enable the hardware acceleration again and close it and just refresh it so that it knows that it's using the hardware acceleration. Now I'm going to hook this laptop to the LCD monitor via a HDMI connection and I'll show you the problem that arises. So I hooked it up to the LCD monitor should come on any second now yeah there we go so just to focus there it is I'm gonna play this video but watch what, watch what happens when I go to full screen see the monitor just went off did you see that yeah and if you play it, I'm betting you that it might happen again. Yeah, so it went off again. So what's actually happening right now? You see that it's going off and on again. So what's actually happening is that um, because Optimus is kicking in, um, the monitor is confused as to take signals from whether uh, the Intel graphics or NVIDIA's graphics. And the annoying thing is it keeps flickering on and off. So. I don't know how this would function if I connect it to a high definition television, but I'm pretty sure this problem would persist with the TV as well. And uh, this is really annoying. The only way to disable this problem is to disable hardware acceleration, which is a bummer. Because, you know, if you have like a high end laptop, you would, you know, logic would dictate that you use the hardware acceleration to take advantage of uh, smooth streaming. But that isn't the case. So this is the problem and um, the only way to fix it is to disable hardware acceleration for now so that you don't have this annoying flickering problem and uh, you know there's no other solution I this is the one that I can think of uh, if you guys have any solutions to this or if you have come up with a response from Dell or if you have anything in mind f please feel free to just let me know I'd be happy to tell others or you know you could tell others as well it would be really helpful and uh, what else yeah people with the core i7 processor and the 435M graphics card need not worry about this issue because um, theirs does not have Optimus and this issue will never arise with their laptops 
and so no need to worry about it. Now let me just plug out the HDMI cable there so that it comes back on. So that's it guys, um, just to take a look at this video and let me know what you guys think and uh, if you have any solutions. Um, that's really a bummer that this problem is there and uh, this concludes the video and I'll be posting this on YouTube for everyone to discuss. Um, thanks and uh, see you guys later.